Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Gabby, and in today's video, we are going to be doing a what's in my overnight bag. This is it. Before we get into today's video, I just wanted to update you guys. The reason why I couldn't upload a video today, which was Saturday, because I just got um, LASIK surgery for my eyes and I no longer wear glasses anymore. So I'm sure if you watched the past two videos, I had glasses on and now I don't. So I just wanted to update you guys. That is the only reason why I couldn't upload on time this week, but I will be uploading on time like before. So the reason why I am making a video, what's my overnight bag, is because I have gotten so many questions from my family, from my coworkers, and some and from some some of my friends. What do I pack? And a lot of the times I'll say it's just stuff I need. I don't really get into it, but since I've been getting so many questions, I figured I would just make one. Now, you're probably wondering what is an overnight shift? It's a graveyard shift, basically. It's like you work from, let's say, 10 p.m. to uh, 7 a.m. Something something along those lines is, is where I pretty much work. And the reason why I work that shift is because I am a DSP, meaning that it's a direct support professional. And my job is where I work with developmental disabled patients or individuals, whichever you would like to call them. I find this job very rewarding. So far, I've, ha I've worked in this field for a year and I really like it. It's, it's like I said, it's very rewarding to work there. Okay, now onto the video. So this bag, I got this bag at Target and originally I had the, the exact same look of the bag it was teal and black and I've had it for about three years and I figured I would just get a new one since this is like more pastel. And I love this type of video, uh, video my goodness. I love this type of bag, sorry. Um, I believe I paid about $34 for this bag. I think it was the same price and whatever products I can find that are still in this bag, I will try to link them down below. Or if I can't find it, I'll try to find something similar. So in this bag, in this part of the bag, so sorry, I believe I have my badge. for work. And then in this part, I have this, this diamond pen that I got from the dollar store. I have a bunch of these Sharpie S gel pens. I currently take medication for anxiety and um, depression, so that's what's in here, in case I forget to take it. Um, let's see. I know I just had it. Oh, Tide Pen. Because sometimes, you know, sometimes we have those days where we have a saying or something. And then, in this little pocket right here. I always like to be prepared. So for some reason, I have three of the wall chargers. I have three of them. So then in this pocket right here, Ooh. 
I have a fan because most of the time at the house, I, I work in a house by the way, it's very hot. I work with um, the elderly, so they get cold quite frequently and you know sometimes I get hot so just fold it there and then over here is a USB port. This one I got from Amazon. Deodorant. <laughs> Very important. And then I have wet ones for sensitive skin. Sometimes I need these. And in the other pocket, I have a portable charger. cotton swabs. I have these to clean my AirPods with. I have a random plastic bag in here. I have a um, Speedway card. I'm not sure why that's in there. Before we get into the big pocket, in this spot right here, I have a flashlight and it's by Embark. So this is self-explanatory, but since I work the graveyard shift, it's dark when I get to work. And um, you know, there's a, like a lot of times there's not that much light out and I couldn't stand using the light on my phone, so it just wasn't bright enough, so I just figured I'd get a flashlight. This, okay, so I have some lip balm. It's by Clarence. I think you can see that. This is my favorite lip balm by far. It's pricey, but it's worth it. And then, even before the pandemic, I would always have hand sanitizer. So now, on this side, I have a cord, charging cord. This one I got from Target. I believe two years ago, so I don't think they had this exact one. I think I got this for $3. And then my AirPods. I got this, the case from, from Amazon. Okay. So now we're gonna be going in the big pocket. So right here, I have a laundry bag. And the reason why I have that is because sometimes, it doesn't happen all the time, but sometimes if I accidentally run into a coworker and something gets spilled on me, it's happened before, I just like to have a little laundry bag with me. And I don't have it on this one for some reason, but I always have an air tag on my bag as well. And if you don't know what an air tag is, it is, you know what, I'm going to show you. I have it in this pocket right here where my keys are. This is what an air tag is. I have my name. And it's just like tile where if you lose your keys or your wallet or your phone, you download a specific app or in this case, if you, are, if you are an iPhone user, you just go on the app Find Me, and then you'll see everything that your AirTag is connected to. I just have that for peace of mind. 
Okay, so in here, I feel like such a mom for having this, but I have some wipes. Even though I let, I, oh my God, I work in a house. We have so many people working there, plus the residents who live there. You know, I just like to be on the safe side. Okay. Got my wallet. going to show it but I just don't feel comfortable so this is just what it is okay this is like my little toiletry bag my mom and my manager oops sorry right here sometimes asks, asks about this this is just stuff I use frequently and I'm going to show you an overview. Okay, this is me right here. So, pads, time of month. I like to be very focused on my like hygiene is very important to me, so I have these Hustle Clean body wipes. I have a couple of them in there. And I have some more wipes. I use water wipes. I know they're for babies, but wet wipes, whatever. Whatever works. And I actually have to get more of these. I have the Summer's Eve. Got some tissues. These are the puffs. Plus lotion. I have some date quill with me, just in case. I have a um, little travel brush, the mini chrome brush, <laughs> and I have some of these like star face. So that way, if I have like a pimple or anything, I would put it on here. Um, I don't, I only get pimples when I'm on, on my period or I eat too much chocolate, which happens a lot. <laughs> and I have some extra masks. These are actually kid masks because I saw a five pack. For, for two bucks at Target. And I'm like, okay, I'll get these. And I didn't register that these were kids, but they work the same. I have some hair ties. So I forgot where I got this from, but it's like mask me spray. So that, you know how in the beginning of the pandemic, everyone was like breaking out over here? Well, it really got me mad that I was breaking out because I, I try to take care of my skin as best as I can. So I figured I would try this and it does work to its extent. I just always forget to use it. So it's always in here. Toothbrush, toothpaste. Honestly, there's some times where, you know, this is very self-explanatory, but sometimes when, when I'm at work and my breath smells bad, sometimes I do it at work, you know, it happens. I got this Cherry Blossom Tea Rose Hand Lotion by Beloved. This is a Target brand. It smells pretty good. I like it before. I think this is my second time having this one. So I don't really use these. These are the um, 
you know those like toilet sprays my mom got me this got me and my sister this for Christmas for like one of those um stocking stuffers it works don't get me wrong but I just I didn't really I really don't use it and then I have more of those Dayquil so that is everything in here I don't know why this is in here. This is the Minute Maid Super Smoothies. Empty, as you can tell. I got this in the dollar store, it's good, but I could have sworn I'd thrown, thrown this out. <laughs> it's okay. And then, these are my keys, like I said. I do have another pocket in here. So, I have my coin purse. I got this from Victoria's Secret and this was also from Victoria's Secret. Then I have a notebook. It has personal inform information in here, so I will not be opening this but I just like to keep it on me in case I ever need it. And then I have this pocket right here. So this has all of my certificates and things like I, I completed and um, at work. I because of safety reasons I'm not going to show my certificates, um, but I will show you this because there's really nothing here. So sometimes when I have to go to a new course that's related to my job, I'll have to write stuff down, or at least I prefer it. I remember things better when I write things down, so I just have my own little pocket here. And then over here I have all my certificates, but for safety reasons, I'm not going to be showing that. And I didn't always have it in here. I used to always store them in a folder but I like to be as organized as I possibly can. So I saw this at Target. I think I spent $10 and I know $10 on a binder is ridiculous, but it came with the binder. It came with like a one inch binder. It came with the dividers and like those little tabs. Otherwise, trust me, I would never spend $10 on a binder ever. Okay. Then in here, and this like, it's hard to see, but like this little pocket, I have my planner. I'm the type of person who always needs a planner on them. And um, I don't go to school anymore, but this is just something I always like keep on hand. I started journaling recently. I got inspired by the Vampire Diaries, not gonna lie. But I, re I noticed that this really does help writing down everything. And I always thought I wouldn't be this type of person. Not that, not that there's anything wrong with that, but this does help a lot. And I'm an open book, you know, pretty much. A lot of people know a lot, a lot of things about me, which is okay. But if I can't access my therapist, this is good too. And that is it. That is everything in my overnight bag. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up and please subscribe. Please let me know down in the comments down below 
or onto my Instagram or Twitter. I will also link that in the description box. And if there is anything I can find, I will try to link them down below or similar products down below. So I hope you guys enjoy and I will see you in my next one. Bye guys.